I got a little frying pan here. It's supposed to be new. Probably has a few scratches. By Toroware. I think Toroware was acquired by Volrath. They acquired wherever. All these little companies, they don't really exist anymore because they were acquired by Volrath. Anyway, this is a Toroware vintage aluminum pan. Look at the little red ribbon. They put a little red ribbon on it. It's supposed to be new. I'm thinking it's 30 to 40 years old. There's not too much information out there about Toro Ware. But they, they made a whole bunch of commercial cookware. It looked nice. And I thought, of course, I thought, oh, I could clean it up. Part of the fun is cleaning it up. And also the handle looked a little different. You know, these commercial handles, they're usually flat. And this looked curved underneath. Let's see. Thank you for your purchase. Yimimi. You're welcome. Ah, she's a little beat up. It is very polished on the inside. And the stamp, Toro stamp, shows through. Very much like Eagle Wear did. Is it... At least it's not handle heavy. All right, it's eight and a half. It's an eight and a half inch skillet. My vintage wherever from 1986. That's a good size. Toro wear by L-E-Y-S-E. -E. I don't know how to pronounce that. Lese, NSF certified. It's very pretty. A little beat up. It says made in USA. It's a 5368 pan. We're gonna have to polish her up with some mother's mag. Maybe maybe cook some eggs. Huh? Toro wear. darn shiny. It's still got some nubbins. Outside is brushed. Bottom's kind of crappy. You can still see the stamps on the inside if you look for them. That won't affect cooking. That's about three passes of Mother's Mag. You gotta make some eggs in it tomorrow morning. slow and slow in an aluminum fry pan. Saturday morning. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. 
Thanks for watching. <laughs>